Did Pepsi partake in subliminal advertising? Today on Nostalgia Sleuth, we're gonna see if we can find out the truth behind the infamous sex cans from Pepsi. The Pepsi Cool Cans were released in 1990. They were distributed from Memorial Day to July 4th. They came in four designs, confetti, sunglasses, neon, and motifs. Here, you can see I have a couple of these, as well as the alleged sex cans we're talking about. Pepsi hadn't done a significant design change to their cans in over 10 years at this point. There was also a contest to win money printed right on the cans. Enjoy the same great Pepsi and limited edition cool cans and you could win cash. Look inside the can. If $25, $100, $500, or $20,000 is printed on the inside bottom, you have won that dollar amount. Game ends September 10th, 1990. This was at a time when Pepsi was rebranding itself. They were trying to rebrand as the teenager soda. The soda for kids. You got Pepsi for me? Who knew? It's your choice. Yes. And it's the choice of a new generation. Uh, in 2002, Snopes actually did an article about it, in which they concluded, yes, it looks like it says sex, that's confirmed, but we cannot confirm that it was done intentionally. A Pepsi representative said, I guess if you look hard enough at clouds in the sky, you could see various images and messages that other people don't see. But still, the legend lives on. So as far as we can tell, this was not done intentionally. And it's kind of, it is a little bit of a stretch, right? But it was just fun. Captured your imagination when you were a kid. Until next time, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. Fuller, go easy on the Pepsi. Oh